Welcome back everybody! Today we're going to get those legs on fire with this 10 minute inner and outer thigh burner workout. You do not need any equipment for today's workout, you just need a little bit of room to move around in. Some of the exercises are going to be on the floor, so if you do have an exercise mat, grab that. Otherwise, the carpet would work or a towel would be fine as well. We are going to go through some combo moves today. So we're going to be working for a solid minute, but we're going to be changing every 20 seconds, and we're going to do eight rounds of those. But of course, don't worry about any of those details. I'm going to be right here doing everything with you and giving you pointers and motivation along the way. So just make sure you have that screen so where it's easy to see, and let's get to it right now. Okay, up first, we're starting in a wide sumo squat. So bring those feet just past shoulder width apart. Point those toes out, we're going down. And up onto those tippy toes. So down into a nice low squat. Push up into those tippy toes. Okay, we're here for 20 seconds. And then we're gonna hold that low squat. Um, pulse it out for 20. And then we're coming back here for the final 20. Okay, nice and slow and controlled. Let's keep tension in those knees, so push those knees out. Okay, get down low, here we go. Hold that low squat, hands can go wherever you need them to go. You just make sure you are getting low in that squat, we're moving it up a couple inches at a time. Feel the burn, oh yeah. So push out with these knees here, keep tension in these inner thighs. Okay, now back into those squats, up to those tippy toes. Nice and controlled. Feel it in those legs. Get nice and low and then get nice and high. You can do it. Woo! Okay, first exercise done. Give those legs a shake. Okay, now we're taking those legs out a little bit wider, okay? And we're gonna go side, 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 side. Okay, so your legs are really wide but you're still stable and then you're coming down and touching with the opposite hand, opposite foot. Okay, we're here for 20 and then we're going to stop moving those arms and just move the legs and hold those arms on the ground in front of us. Okay, make sure you're still breathing. Okay, okay hold those hands in front of you like this. Now just move those legs. Okay. Just if, however you can get those hands down there. I just want you to move those legs. I want you to feel a tension or a stretch in these inner thighs. Okay. Back to the first exercise. So now we're using our hands. Try to keep that chest up as well. Woo! Keep breathing. Let's feel those legs. Start to burn. You're doing great. Woo. Okay, now we're coming down to the net. So we're going to start with our right leg on top. And we're going to come onto our shoulders like this. Actually, we're going to come onto our hand. And we're going to lift that leg up and down. Up and down. Okay, here we go. Lift that leg up and down, up and down. Okay, once we do this 20 seconds, option two, just hold that leg parallel with your hip or add little pulses. But holding it will also be quite challenging. So here we go, hold it up there. Now, depending on how you're feeling, you can add little pulses here, just so slightly. Woo, it's gonna burn. Trust me, it's gonna burn. But I want you to also try to stay nice and like nice and square here as well. So get that leg up as high as you can. If you can just hold it there, you just hold it there. Woo, okay, back to those lifts. Here we go. You're doing awesome. I know it burns, but just think about those nice, long toned legs we're working on right now. Okay. Only a few more seconds here and then we're on to the, now, the other leg. Okay, come on. Shake it out. Shake that booty out. Shake those legs out. Of course, we're going to do the other leg. So come on to the other side now. Get nice and strong. Hand right underneath that shoulder. Other hand wherever you need it to go. Now we're going up and down. Up and down. Okay, get 
breathing. Here we go. Let's go. Got to work this leg just as hard as you did the other one. You want both legs to look nice and long and sexy. Here we go. Feel the burn in those legs. Next, same thing. Option to hold or add little pulses. Here we go. Hold that leg up there. Option to add a little pulse if you want to. Just take, listen to your body, see what you can do. I want you up here. So I don't want that leg to drop for the full 20 seconds. So if that requires no pulses, you don't do pulses. Okay, come on. Okay, here we go. Come on, final 20 on this leg. You can do it. Nice and high, let's get that leg right up to parallel. Make sure you're breathing as well. Don't forget about that, that's very important. You can do it, come on. Woo! Okay, now we're going back to the other leg. So we're coming down onto our side like this. And we're gonna take our hand under our knee. And then we're gonna take that knee here and then kick it back to the floor kick it back, to the floor, kick it back, okay, come on, let's go, so, knee is coming just in front of the other leg, and then you're kicking it back on a 45, okay, get it back there nice and far, you can do it, okay, now, hold that leg out there, hand in front to support you, and you're bringing that bottom leg up to meet the top leg. Okay, I know this one's gonna be a challenge, but hey, try it, see what you can do, and then try to get better next time. Come on, we're here for another three seconds, come on. Okay, back to the first one, knee to the front, kick it back, front, kick it back. Okay, come on. I know it's starting to burn, but that's good. We're here together. Okay, roll over to the other side, same thing. Okay, so we're starting with that top leg. Bottom leg is just straight out. We're coming down to the front and kick it back. Front, kick it back. Okay, here we go. Okay, make this leg burn just as much as the other. You're doing great. You're doing awesome. We've already got a couple more exercises to go. I promise. Okay, come on. Point that torus, really lengthen that leg at the back. Okay, now take that leg out, nice and straight, and we're bringing that bottom leg up to meet the top one. Okay, here we go. I know it's a challenge. Challenge yourself. Don't roll over. Make sure to stay nice and hips right on top of each other. Okay, come on, get that leg up there. Woo! Okay, now bring that knee back into the front and kick it back. Front and kick it back. Only a couple more exercises to go, I promise. Finish this strong. Stay with me. Make sure you're breathing. Make those legs burn. Woo! Okay, now we're going to do some big scissors. So we're gonna, I'm going to sit like this so you can see what's going on with my legs. We're going to lay on our back. Hands to support our head like this. Legs straight up. We're going out and across. Out and cross. So we're alternating which foot comes in front of the other. Okay, we're here for 20. And then we're gonna hold those legs out to the side and pulse them with little pulses. Okay, if you can, let's move those legs a little faster. Really work those inner thighs here. You can do it. Okay, hold those legs out. Now let's pulse them. Let's work on that both side splits that I cannot do. But hey, you might be able to. Come on. Let's work it. Let's pulse it. Nice little pulses. Make sure you're breathing. Don't forget about that. Okay, we're going back to those crisscross. Okay, bring it in and out. Stay with me. Stay strong. You can do it. Woo, feel those in those inner thighs. Oh yeah, nice and strong. Let's move those legs a little faster if we can. Woo, okay, breathe. 
Bring those legs into your chest. Roll over onto your back. Or stay on your back. Sorry, I'm going to go sideways so you can see what's going on. Okay, final, final combo. Leg goes out into a hollow body hold. So make sure you're using your abs as well on this one. Hands behind your head to support. We're tapping those feet together. Nice and strong with intention. No floppy legs, okay? No floppy legs. Nice and fast. Here we go. Come on. 20 seconds here. Then we're going to move on to frog legs. Okay, come on. Stick it in. Nice and strong. Really strong legs on this one. Okay, now bring those legs in and out like a frog. So I really want you to take those knees out to the side of your body. Out and out. Okay, come on. Only less than a minute to go, guys. Less than a minute. Only one more of those ones. Fast, strong legs. Here we go. Nice and fast pulses here. Tap those feet together. Nice and strong. Crush whatever is between your feet there. Make sure your abs are turned on as well. Suck that back to the floor as well. If your knee gets tired, let's rest it on the floor. If you need to bring those legs up top, okay? Come on. Woo! Okay, bring those legs to your chest. Give them a shake. Double high five. You guys are amazing. I'm so proud of you. I hope you enjoyed this workout. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you're new here, make sure you're hitting that big subscribe button and turning on those notifications so you don't miss out on our new workouts. If this is your final workout of the day, make sure you are cooling down and stretching properly. There is a link to a 10 minute cool down and stretch in the description of this video. If you want to keep working out, I have less than suggested workouts that you could do with this one in the description of the video as well. Otherwise, you can check out my YouTube channel and see what interests you. If you have any questions or concerns, please do reach out to me. Otherwise, I will see you again very, very, very soon. Until next time, bye.